Hey guys, it's Sam. I make medically related videos and today I'm going to be talking about my first day of medical school. So my first actual day of medical school was last Friday. It was orientation, but that really consisted of seven or eight hours of sitting in rooms for Zoom meetings and I just got a little bag of goodies. I'll show you what I got here in a second, but that wasn't actually a day of class. It was just more or less sitting in rooms while professors lectured you over Zoom. Some of the things they gave me in that goodie bag, I have my little name tag with my photo on it. Actually, not little, it's actually kind of big. If you put it up next to me, it's pretty big. And then the code of medical ethics, uh, that was in the bag, along with two uh, Tulane masks, and those were pretty cool too. Today, we actually got to interact a little bit more with our classmates, which I was happy about. We got our TLC groups, which is kind of a support group throughout medicine and medical school, which I think is really good because my school places a lot of emphasis on wellness and student health. So they're grouping us up into six where you can just kind of, you know, share your thoughts and feelings on things. And we have a mentor on top of that. So we got introduced to them today. Uh, we also had some really informative uh, presentations on the history of New Orleans and social and uh, socio-demographic uh, inequities and how those played out and how those got to where we are today. Uh, really great presentation by one of the clinicians here. And yeah, we just got into actual meat and actual material of stuff today. It's some, some things on professionalism and anti-racism. So today was really the first day of class and the first day I got to meet my classmates. And while today was really good for what it was, I am a little bit bummed out about certain things that we won't be able to do this semester. Like anatomy lab, for one, we're not sure if we're going to have it all this semester and possibly not even next semester, depending on the situation of the pandemic. Another thing we won't be doing is the student run clinics, which usually at around the first month, Tulane students actually go out in the clinics and they're at least part of the, the team providing care to patients and those won't be running anytime soon now. So that patient interaction and kind of that hands-on experience with anatomy is not gonna be a part of my first year, or at least for now, which really kind of bums me out because that's what I was looking forward to the most uh, was the anatomy part of it. Because I'm, I'm personally, I'm looking into orthopedic surgery, uh, dermatology, or plastic surgery at this time. So really with all three of those, uh, I would love to have and, and just be in the lab, uh, anatomy lab, and, you know, do dissections and go through the process of uh, dissecting a cadaver and, you know, appreciating those who donated their bodies to science and just, you know, that whole experience. I feel like it's a rite of passage for a medical student that I won't be getting to take a part in. That being said, I don't want this message to come across as me ragging on Tulane School of Medicine because I think Tulane School of Medicine did an absolutely phenomenal job with this orientation. They made it so that we could have the most interaction with other students and get to meet our classmates while maintaining social distancing. Um, shout out to all the staff, shout out to all the faculty, shout out to all the year two, three, and four students and even some physicians that made this happen. Uh, it is not easy to get 190 students six feet apart in downtown New Orleans. That's not an easy task, and they pulled that off. Uh, so I really want to shout out to my school uh, for pulling this off. You guys are great, and I'm very happy to be a part of Tulane School of Medicine. So yeah, that's my overall take on the first day of medical school. It was a little bit underwhelming to me, but at the same time, even though it was underwhelming to me, I think my school and staff went all out for it. So I'm really excited about just being on board with them. Uh, if you guys like this video, drop me a like below and please subscribe to me. Uh, also, you can follow me on Instagram at Samuel Hines. Uh, I'll leave that in the description below. And I'm going to give you a little show of the city of New Orleans right now because I'm not ready to do my apartment tour yet. So yeah, I'll do that right about now. This, that's downtown area, and right over there you can see those lights. That is the Superdome, so our charm of New Orleans. Yeah, it's a really cool view though. 